Here I have HTC Desire 530 and let me show you how to bypass Google verification the following device. So let me show you how to remove the factor reset protection. So as you can see at some point of initializing setup process you have to input your Google account email and password and let me show you how to skip this point. So at the very beginning let's activate a keyboard right here. Let's just use the settings icon right here. So let's hold down settings. Here you have to scroll down and choose personal dictionary, choose HTC VR the first option, let's highlight this word HTC VR, choose share, here you've got the Gmail, let's hold down the Gmail for a couple of seconds, so hold down the Gmail icon, the following menu should pop up, choose notifications, select app settings, Afterwards, let's use a more key and choose manage accounts, tap continue, excellent. Now we can use the settings of HTC Desire 530 and let's scroll down to choose Google, choose Google, here you have to choose the more key right here, sorry you have to choose the search and now right here so let's choose search and now afterwards let's select now cards choose let me choose the show cards let me enable show cards select no thanks now you can use a google searcher so let's type in chrome here we've got the chrome application let's tap it now you can use the Chrome, but at first you have to choose accept and continue, choose no thanks to signing in, and let's use the following website, download, dot hard reset, dot info. Of course the link will be also in the description, under the video, let's tap search download.hardreset.info here you have to choose the HTC folder so as you can see this is the HTC folder let's tap it and here you should choose the hardreset.info shortcut maker the second app right here so let's choose hardreset.info shortcut choose update permissions tap allow chrome to access photos media and files on your device tap ok Downloading is in process. Now you can choose open right here. This is this application, so let's open this app. Install blocked, but let's choose settings. Let's enable the unknown sources right here, tap OK. Let's go back and let's open this application one more time. Choose install. The quick shortcut maker is installing, choose accept. app is installed so now you can open this application let's choose open and now you can use the input keyword filter so let me type in here google account Man manager google account this is the google account manager let's tap it and now you should find the Google account manager, the email and password right here. This is the Google account manager, email and password. Let's tap it. Let's choose try. And now you have to choose the more key in that corner, the three dots, choose browser sign in, tab OK. And now you have to log into a Google account. It should be your Google account. It's it not it not it can be the different Google account not connected to this device. So you can use all Google accounts. You can even create a new Google account and use it right here. So let me just input my Google account not connected to this device.
excellent let's tap next let's enter a password so let me do it excellent let's choose the sign in and that's it now all you have to do is simply press power key right here choose restart the HCC desire is restarting Excellent. Now the welcome panel just pops up. Let's choose start right here. Scroll down. Let's choose next. Tap next again. Tap OK. Choose next. Let me skip for now. Choose skip anyway. Scroll down. Let's choose next. Let me unclick the blah blah car application. Let's choose finish. Excellent. Now you can use your device, but to erase completely the factor protection, let's choose the apps icon, choose settings, scroll down. Choose backup and reset. Choose reset phone. And let's tap OK to confirm this operation. Tap OK one more time. Let me choose OK as I said. Now the device is performing the hard reset operation, but this time the HTC will also erase the factor reset protection completely. So let's just wait until the whole operation will be completed. Do not interrupt while the process is running. Let's wait until the welcome panel pops up. Excellent, the welcome panel just pops up, so let's go through the initializing setup process. Let's choose start, scroll down, choose next. Let me tap next, let me don't connect my device to a Wi-Fi, just so choose skip anyway. Scroll down, tap next again, choose next. 
let me skip for now, skip anyway, scroll down, choose finish, and now let me make sure that device doesn't have a Google account connected, so let's choose settings, scroll down again, choose accounts and synchronization, and as you can see there is no Google account, so it means that you erase the factorial protection on this device, everything went well. Thank you for watching, please subscribe our channel and leave thumbs up under the video.